How's it going everybody? Gary Simon here and today I am releasing a summer sale for designcourse.com, the UI UX course uh, at designcourse.com. And so if you use the coupon code SUMMER50 right here on the screen, you'll get 50% off of the course, which is a huge discount that we don't uh, hardly ever offer. And we're going to be doing this for the next 48 hours. All right, so for those of you who don't already know about the course, I'm going to walk you through what the course is. I'm going to show you the curriculum, and then also I'm going to show you another thing that another course that I'm in progress of working on, which is an interactive CSS course, which is coming, I hope, within the next two months. And I'll talk about that at the end. Um, so yeah, if you go to designcourse.com, which is linked here in the top link of the YouTube description, um, this is the landing page for it. and. I, what it is essentially, it's not just video. Typical courses, you know, in either de the design or the coding space are typically just video based courses, but this is much more than that. All right, so there's actually, I'm gonna scroll down here, 16 hours of video, and there are also 38 tests. Now, what are the tests? Uh, these are, uh, it's an interactive. I, I guess you could say UI test platform. We call it UI as in U E Y E. Very clever. And these are just examples of some of the tests that you can take, and they help you develop an eye for UI design fundamentals. Now, all of this is coded from custom. Nobody else has this. Uh, so for instance, uh, like a URL shirt shortener, um, you can see over here, if I zoom up, we have uh, just basically all the different UI design fundamentals. You have to choose which fundamental is has been improperly placed on this particular design. Like, what is wrong about this? Well, I can tell you right now, the weird font, that's kind of strange looking, so I'm gonna say topography. All right, so I was gonna fix that up. Now, because it hasn't told me the test isn't complete yet, I, there's something else that's wrong, all right? So you basically have to work your, your, your way through that the contrast on that little item down there was incorrect. You have to work your way through and then you can build points. It's kind of like a gamified system. Um, so there's a bunch of those, 38 of those worked within the course. Um, and there are also, if I go back here, we have 22 projects. Now these projects are challenge-based project and it's actually 12 of them. And then you get 10 extra uh, submissions if you join the mentor program, which I'll talk about, uh, where I'll, I will review your projects. So let me show you the actual curriculum. So here are all the chapters, uh, a part of the curriculum. And uh, let's just start with design fundamentals. You can see uh, we have these little icons next to each one of them. And this is just signifying the four different types of modules that we have. Uh, so up here where it has a little list, we actually have many courses worked within this cur curriculum. So we start off with UI design fundamentals. Um, we also have individual videos right here. And then we have those tests and the tests kind of follow along with the flow of the curriculum. So whatever you learned in the previous videos, it's gonna put you to the test essentially. Um, and then there are also the challenges right here. As you can see, uh, it has this little icon right here, your first challenge. And what does the challenge look like? Well, essentially, uh, there's a video that introduces the challenge. You download a Figma prototype and you'll see this screen right here essentially. And it just tells you um, what the challenge is. What do I want you to design based on what you learned previous? And what's really cool is the mentor program uh, because if you have not joined the mentor program, it will show you. Um, by the way, let me go ahead and just find one real quickly. Yeah, so if we click on here and if you haven't joined the mentor program, uh, for this particular or, or any challenge, it'll show join mentor program right here. So the cool thing about mentor program is you can join just the regular course uh, and, and pay you know the forty nine dollars or what, whatever it would be for your summer fifty coupon code, um, and then you can add on mentor pro program later. And mentor program is a subscription service right here. All right, so that basically is forty nine bucks a month, but I believe the summer fifty will apply towards that to take off some money. Um, and what it is is when you join, you're able to submit your prototype that you created for the individual challenges. And by submit, I mean, I literally, me, not anybody else, I take a look at them and I rate them. And here's what my system looks like on the back end. I, like for instance, I haven't, these are the ones that are still pending in queue for uh, being reviewed. So if I click on this one, this was for a particular challenge for the hero section design. So if I take a look at their Figma prototype, um, I will 
say, okay, there's a number of things that need to be fixed about this. And I'll open up a new document, I'll copy and paste theirs in, and I will literally revise it for them. And so the fact that I'm only charging 49 bucks for this per month, which I think the average person get done in about three months, um, and they're getting my direct feedback is huge. So they've locked these layers. I'm gonna say they probably don't need this background right here for this element. So we can just get rid of that. We could probably expand this, maybe just uh, to, to fill out the design a little bit more. Maybe we'll uh, push this over. I'm gonna increase this real quick, move this over here. I think we're a little bit low uh, on the contrast. We could probably boost that contrast up more. And then finally, I will probably make the adjustment of removing this and I'm gonna change this to our primary purple color that's found elsewhere throughout the nav, and then just make the, um, the button color, lose fat, uh, to white, and then move this down, and there we go. As you can see, I've opened up the, uh, the design much more. And so what I would do also is I leave a comment kind of describing what I've done right here, and then I also go back to my system, um, which is right here, I'll leave my name, a rating from one to 10, one being the uh, worst and 10 being the best. I'll leave that uh, comment there as well. And then I'll link the new Figma document where you, that person can check out the actual uh, feedback and any um, iterations that I created. And so th through the mentor program, people are able to see exactly what I would do to fix their design. And ultimately it helps people become great designers. So. Outside of that, in the curriculum, um, if I can find the curriculum again, let me just go back here. Uh, we also have live UI UX workshops. So right now, um, they're every two weeks and it's hosted via Zoom. And um, yeah, the next one is in seven days. And people could just join and they can. Ju it's just another way for them to get feedback from me. You don't even have to be a part of the mentor program. So I can still take a look at your projects every two weeks or so. All right, um, and then also there is a, a Discord server for members only. So if anybody who's paid, everybody gets access to the Discord server. Um, and this is the server. We also have roles, like if you join Mentor, you show up over here. Um, and there's a, there's a channel for each of the, the major chapters. So you, people can go there, they can ask questions and get help from the community, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. All right, so definitely use Summer 50 to get that 50% off to join today. And then finally, um, if you haven't yet, then definitely check out uh, designcourse.com forward slash CSS, where you can enter your email to be notified when our CSS course releases. It's going to be interactive as well, which is really cool. Just like our UI UX course, how we have custom interactive modules, there's going to be custom interactive modules for learning C HTML and CSS in order to build layouts. All right, so that means uh, if, if you, we're gearing it really towards uh, primarily like UI designers. So it's gonna be based on Figma prototypes and then just how do you take this particular module, uh, not module, or component, maybe we start at the component level, not full layouts, and we use both Flexbox and the CSS grid eventually to create full layouts. And basically you learn from scratch how to use HTML and CSS to make your designs a reality because I think that's really important for UI designers to understand at least on a fundamental level, how to translate their designs to HTML and CSS in the browser. All right, so that was a lot of talking. Uh, hopefully you guys join up, you take advantage of this 48 hour offer, summer 50, and I will see you all soon, goodbye.